द प्लेस वैल्यू ऑफ द डिजिट चेंजेस अकॉर्डिंग टू द प्लेस इट ऑक्यूपाइज फेस वैल्यू ऑफ अ डिजिट रिमेन्स द सेम एट ऑल द प्लेसेज एज वी हैव सी इन द नंबर फिफ्टी एट If we exchange the digits of fifty-eight, we have number eighty-five. Both these numbers have five and eight. But why are they different? In the number eighty-five, the face value and place value of five are same. That is five, but the face value of eight is eight, and the place value is eighty. There are eight tens and five ones in the number eighty-five. In the base ten number system, the value of each place is ten times the value of the place immediately to its right. We take an example one hundred and twenty-three. Here, three is in the ones place, two is in the tens place, and one is in the hundreds place. Starting with the number three. Three multiplied by one is equal to three, as it is the rightmost digit of the number. Taking the number two, two multiplied by ten is twenty. This means the place value of two is ten times higher than the place value of one's place. So we multiply it with ten. Similarly, if we take the number one, one multiplied by ten, multiplied by ten, that is hundred. The place value of one is ten times higher than that of its immediately right place, that is the tens place. Hence, its place value is given by multiplying ten into ten, that is hundred. Hence, the place value of one is one hundred here. If we add the value of all the digits, we get one hundred and twenty-three. Writing numbers using spike abacus. Here, this is a abacus. There is no bead in the ones place. So we write zero. Again in the tens place there is no bead. We write zero. In the hundreds place we have five beads. One, two, three, four, and five. So in the hundreds place we will write five. It is five hundred. Taking another example. There are three bits in the ones place, so we write three. There are five bits in the tens place, so we write five. And there are four bits in the hundreds place, so we write four. The number is four hundred and fifty-three. Taking another example, in this. In the ones place, we have one bead. We write one in the ones place. In the tens place, how many beads are there? One, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. There are seven beads in the tens place. And in the hundreds place, there are four beads. We write four in the hundreds place. What number is it? The number is four hundred and seventy-one.
Moving on to the next example. In the ones place we have two beads. So we write two in the ones place. In the tens place again we have two beads. So we write two in the tens place as well. In the hundreds place we have two beads again. So we write two in the hundreds place. The number is two hundred and twenty-two. This is interesting to read in a backus. 